I think it's 121, you butt muncher. Why is there always just fat fucking levels in these lobbies? I'm not really a free-for-all guy, but you know, overall in like domination lobbies and when it came to, you know, just playing in general, there is so many beast guys. You can have a perfect lobby of Christmas noobs, and then there's some motherfucker that's level 350 that just comes out of nowhere and dicks on all you guys. I feel like that also is like in, the, in life too. There's always like one person that just like, it's like, I wouldn't say competitive with you, but there's always one person just to ruin it. Thinking about putting out a BO3 only montage, you know, if you guys are like long time subscribers, I was gonna put out this montage, this multi con montage called Deception. And I realized, I don't know, if I can pull off like a full on montage with BO3 only because like that's just insane and you know maybe maybe I'll have some older cards in there but like overall I think I'm gonna like try to bring out a montage you guys as soon as possible no promises though but I'm gonna try to be working on one I know I upload videos every day and you know like I try to entertain you guys and I can't think as enough for that but I still you know try to grind for clips and whatnot and I know like a lot of clips do not shove my videos and that's okay it's my luck like literally I upload a video and then I hit a clip right after it's stupid like that split five on breach I literally hit that five minutes before my videos uploaded i want to give a big warm shout out to butters uh you know she's one of my youtube friends i've known her for a while now and you know i'm actually glad because she you know she joined soar last night you know her videos are really awesome i'll make sure and leave like you know her youtube link and her twitter link in the description below make sure you go follow her she deserves it and you know i'm super happy for her. i'm glad i'm so glad when friends get in teams like even if i like i don't get in like i'm so happy that friends get in like you know gilly gone bay max gone bay you know all these like all my good friends butters gone soar i'm actually so glad that they get in sore and like get in obey because they actually deserve it. If you guys like my videos, I think you'll enjoy Butter's videos, and you know, she's one of my really good friends. So, you I'll be really happy for you guys. If you guys support me, please support her, she definitely deserves it. That just happened. That easily could have been more, but you know, it's, it's all good. It's all good. I've always had like those experience stories and like situations that you guys can somewhat relate to, you know, like back in like fourth and fifth grade and like even like in high school and stuff. And you know, I, I always talked about, you know, how like, you know, if you're fast in elementary school, you always got all the girls. There's a few more things that can actually like relate to that topic. Like, you know, like I remember in elementary school, if you had like really good, like if you had cool shoes or you had cool shirts or whatever. Like, I remember I was, like, so... I was so self-conscious about, like, what I wore and stuff. Like, like even in, like, 8th grade, 7th grade, like, for, I would say elementary school and, you know, middle school, I was the most self-conscious. And the thing is, like, we all have, you know, we all have, like, flaws. And, like, I know I'm not, like, I'm not trying to fucking act like a fucking faggot here and, like, you know, talk like a chick. I don't know. It's just, like, I was thinking about it and, like, everyone is, like, you know, everyone has flaws. Like, Everyone is self-conscious, so you gotta, you gotta relax, you know, everyone has those times, you know, it's just like, like, I know, I know I have a fat forehead, like, I got a melon. And I remember I was, like, really self-conscious in elementary school, like, really, really self-conscious. But I would say I was more self-conscious when it came to, like, 7th and 8th grade, because, you know, I wasn't really the, I was always, like, the average Joe, I wasn't, like, popular but I wasn't like, you know, like unpopular. I was like, just like the average Joe, you know, I, I didn't have like that many friends, you know, I had like, just, I just had like a group of just good friends. A good group of friends that I've been playing water polo with for like, you know, a long time. And like, you know, I'm always, I have acquaintances. I have acquaintances with people, but you know, I just have like that good solid group of friends that you always hang out with and you, like you always, you know, talk to and whatnot. And I wouldn't say it's good to be self-conscious, but you know, we've all been there. We all have, you know, our flaws and like, we're, we're always self-conscious about something. I remember there was this one dude in elementary school that would always be so competitive with me no matter what he like always wanted to be faster always wanted to like you know try to go for the girl i liked or you know fucking take my like my encrustable always trying to fucking compare you know like he has better food than me or like you know just has like better fucking capri suns all right well i guess my xbox is just gonna automatically just turn off pretty much you know just don't be so don't be so self-conscious because you, you gotta realize like okay everyone has like these different flaws make sure you're happy you know make sure you're doing something you're happy keep killing it you know just do what you gotta do you know fuck those guys you know they're ball sacks and you know just we're all we're all happy we're all good looking in some way and you know just keep killing it man i fucking love you guys What a fucking ball sack. I go negative for dark matter.
Wild Mexican looks like a fucking cornbread. I still got a lot of shit to learn, I'll admit it. It's the done, the done, the. I still got a lot of shit to learn, I'll admit it. Feeling like a digit in a system, just another stupid.